Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be focusing on the cab of my 1968 C10. So as you can see in these old clips, the roof was in horrible condition. I'm sure a lot of you guys from the States haven't seen anything quite this bad, but down here with the ocean right next to us, there's salt in the air, and then in the winter there's salt on the road. It just chews up anything that's metal. But luckily for you guys, it makes some pretty interesting content. You can actually see outside, from inside the cab, through the roof. It's gonna get fixed properly, but it's not gonna be like a show truck or anything like that. But don't get me wrong, it's gonna be a nice interior, but I just don't wanna spend 10,000 hours on little pieces on the cab, because it'll never get finished. So without making you wait anymore, I'm gonna get right to it and start cutting the old roof. To fix the roof, I cut off this piece. It's pretty rusty, but it's just enough material to give me my pattern. Here's my miniature template. I'm gonna make a longer piece with this exact shape. That's gonna extend all the way across the roof, and it'll connect this part of the roof to the piece I'm gonna make with this template. So this is the template I made earlier. All I want to do is have these exact bends while keeping the same height, but I want to extend it out further so that it covers the whole length of the roof. Also to know the exact width of the sheet you're going to need, I take a piece of tape, cover the surface area of my template, then I rip off the ends, peel it back. This piece of tape is the exact width of sheet you need. And then to bend the piece of sheet metal you have, very simple, you find a nice straight edge, you cover your sheet with something straight again. You take some C-clamps, clamp it down, and then you grab a body hammer and you tap away to get that perfect bend. So I need some more metal to make a piece for the roof, like this one that I removed. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys how this piece was made before. I don't know if it's gonna focus right there. You can see that it's like 80% body fill and then 20% metal. So uh, that's quite hilarious. Hopefully I can fix it a little better than that. It shouldn't be too hard, but let's go out in the yard, find some metal, and we'll recreate that piece. It's quite windy out here, I hope you can hear me, but I found just what I was looking for. Another old fridge, just like my fender flares. I thought it was stupid to keep these old fridges, but man, do they ever come in handy when you're looking for some sheet metal.
All right, so the roof is pretty much completed. This is the steel from the old fridge. And um, I showed you the template I made earlier for this piece. So it's two pieces and then they're just welded together. When that's all grinded down and all the bodywork is done, it's gonna look brand new. Night and day difference between before and after on the roof of the cab. I'm very happy with it. Um, it's pretty much ready to be uh, primed. So that's gonna be very exciting. It's gonna look great when it's primed and even better when it's painted. But hopefully you're enjoying this build. There's a lot more content coming. With that being said, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.